Joaquin Phoenix, ladies and gentlemen. You know, I've always liked you. I've, I've, I've been to see your movies. I've always <laughs> liked you. I, I recognize you as a, as a powerful talent. Uh, the Johnny Cash thing, you were tremendous in that. Thank you. Thank you. And then a year and a half ago, you come out, and uh, honestly, it's like you slipped and hit your head in the tub. <laughs> And, and I uh, uh, knew immediately when you sat down, something ain't right. Because if you're really the way you appeared to be, you don't go out. <laughs> you, you know what I mean? People don't let guys like you out if you're really like that. You don't, you don't go out. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so what do you have to say for yourself? Well... Uh, thank you for letting me come on the show. Yes, last well, we've, time. Been, we've been dying to have you back a year and a half. Uh huh. No, I meant last time. Mm -hmm. uh, but this time as well. Mm -hmm. um, no, we wanted to make this film. You and who wanted to make Casey it? Casey Affleck. Yeah, right. Uh, who to make who this knew film. about it? You, whose idea was it? Uh, it was both of our idea. Mm -hmm. uh, and, the, we... and the idea being what? <laughs> uh, well, we wanted to do a film that explored celebrity. Um, and explored the relationship between the media and the consumers and the celebrities themselves. Um, and, you know, we, we wanted something that would feel really authentic. Um, I I'd started watching a lot of reality shows, and um, I was amazed that, that people <laughs> believed them, that they called them, like, reality. I thought the only reason why is because it's billed as being real right. and, and the people use their real names. Mm -hmm. But the acting is terrible. It seems orchestrated. And, they, I'll give you is. that. It, it seems orchestrated. It but seems I manipulated. I, uh, I thought I could handle that. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Because you, you don't have to be very good. Right. And you just <laughs> you just use your name, and, and, and people think that it's real. Right. Um, so it was just this idea that we had, and, and to be frank, we didn't really know how the media or the public was going to respond. I mean, when I first made the, the announcement that I was retiring, which I, I thought in and of itself was... Um, a joke, you know, because right. you have a 35 year old that says he's retiring from acting. Yes. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but I didn't really know if, if anyone would care. And uh, frankly, I assumed that they wouldn't. Mm -hmm. um, but it kind of snowballed and became this big thing. And, and then we came on, on the show, or right. rather, I came on the show here, and, and uh, that got a lot of attention. Okay, now let me ask you a couple of questions. First mm -hmm. of all, are you retiring to, to pursue a career in music? Uh, uh, to, to me, that seems. Uh, excuse me, I mean, you did sing in the, the film, but it seems unlikely because you've been nominated for two Academy Awards. I frankly, when I heard about it later, was surprised that anybody had believed it. And then after seeing you here, first of all, it, it, really all I care about is me in this. Now, <laughs> um, <laughs> now, did I know anything about this? No. Yeah. Was, was there a script that you and I were working with? No. Thank you very much. I, I was <laughs> but, not part of it, was I? Yeah, but l like you said, I mean, I think that you've, you've interviewed many, many people, and I assume that you would kind of know the difference between uh, a character right. and, um, and, and, and a real person. Um, so, but, but, I, but I apologize. I, I, I didn't, uh, I hope I didn't offend you oh, in no. any way. Oh, by no, 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 no. I was not offended. Okay. I'm okay, telling good. you, it was so much fun. It really, it was <laughs> good. Yeah. Well, we just... It was batting practice, you know what I mean? <laughs> Every one of them was a dinger. Yeah. It was. Well, we, we'd, we'd hoped to, um, to come on a, on, a, on a talk show, and um, I was looking for a beatdown, and uh, I got one. <laughs> I, want, I really... I want to thank you for that. Yeah. Um, now, there was a, a, a moment that I uh, heard about, uh, I guess, earlier this week that I was not aware of it, that, what are you doing? <laughs> don't, don't go south on me tonight, all right? I'm just checking. I wanted to make sure it was cleaned up. That's it. Oh, is this, you put your gum down there before? Um, we're, we're, we're at the end of uh, our chat the last time you were here, uh, you, you sort of a, you broke the character. You, you, you were the, the, the dope in the beard, and then uh, at the end of the segment, you took off your sunglasses and everything was fine. Do you remember that? I do remember Let, Let's that. look at that, because that apparently, uh, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, play, pay close attention to this. <laughs> 
Is thank you very much and good luck in your new career. I hope that goes well for you. We'll be right back with Model Bar. Rep by Ellie. I don't know. I, you can't no. indict on that, I don't think. Yeah, I. Uh, now, your, I, your director, uh, Casey Affleck, Casey was, was upset about it. very angry with yeah. me when I did that. Um, and there were qu quite a few things, actually, that were out in public that um, seemed very much over the top um, that we thought were, like, thought it was really obvious that people would know that it wasn't real. Um, and... Uh, and yeah, I got in a lot. I got in a lot of trouble for that uh, from Casey. But I just was. I was eager to thank you uh, for the opportunity, and I was really eager to get off the show. Uh. Um, <laughs> so That's I just, how everybody but, feels. <laughs> uh, no, it's not. But now, wait a minute. See, I just, I just thought it was uh, uh, fun, and, and you talk about, but were, were you worried in doing this that you would so alienate people either uh, by doing it or f finding out later what you had done that your career might actually be in jeopardy somehow? Uh, I certainly knew that there was that risk. Mm -hmm. um, uh, I'm not sure I have much of a career. Uh, now, um, no, I, I think that that we we knew that and we were willing to take that right. risk. Um, and looking back at it now, was it worth taking the risk? Yeah, hundred percent. Really? Yeah. In I what sense? Just the, the, the pursuit of because um, the experience was incredible. I mean, I, I wanted to to make a film in a different way, right. and we wanted to develop our own system, um, and and we just felt like it was it was possible, and you know, and, and so we just tried to do something that was. That was different and the experience was um, very gratifying um, you know there's some things I feel bad about I know like dr. Drew was what lost was some the, sleep what was the deal on him he diagnosed me based on the interview here yeah. and um, <laughs> <laughs> and, and you, you know what, what did he come up with? I can't, I can't, I can't remember what it was, but uh, he obviously cares a great deal about um, the people that he has on his show and such, so um, I, I felt, you know, bad about that. Yeah. Um, well, what did he have to say about me? I don't care about you. Yeah. What did he say about me? Nah, I, what did he say? You're a genius. Yeah, oh, that's right. That's, exa that's right. That's exactly what happened. Um, And then the movie comes out, and uh, and somehow I got the sense of uh, that I had been made a fool of, and that I really got to thinking, what, me? How did that happen? I don't uh, is, know if that people happened. go see that movie and they they because quite a lot of the that show is in the movie, is that mm -hmm. right? Yeah, it is. I think the interview that night, a year and a half ago, lasted uh, almost 11 minutes, and there's almost five minutes of that interview in in the film. Mm -hmm. Now, how do I come off? Do I come off good or yeah, do, do I come off like a like a jerk? No, I don't think you come off as a jerk. I think yeah. you. you... <laughs> now wait. No, 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 no. Wait a minute. No, 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 no. What is no, that? I don't. Honestly, uh, <laughs> it, it, it was perfect, and it was everything. Well, I that played we... right into your hands, didn't I? Essentially, you came out looking for a beatdown, and you got one. Yes. Yeah. But it's, I, I, is it edited in such a way to make it look like, oh, poor Joaquin, big dumb Dave is picking on poor Joaquin? No, I, I, I don't think so. I, so you haven't seen the film? No. Oh, yeah. um, because everyone else has. <laughs> You're the only one in America because it's I, You know, I hate waiting in lines. Yeah. It's, it's, <laughs> it's a long line, yeah. All right. And we'll be right back with Joaquin Phoenix, everybody. <laughs> so I uh, now I want some money. <laughs> Because we get a call one day, and they say, it's the film company, uh, Magnolia Movies, or whatever you call it, and uh, they say, uh, we just want to let you know that uh, we want to get your approval that we're using a, a duck face in the uh, promotion for the film. 
And we say, well, what are you talking about? And they said, well, he's going to be in the, the, the trailers that run on the coming attractions. And they said, well, no, we never said it. And they said, oh, yeah, and, and also uh, he's in the film. And I said, well, we never said, nobody ever asked us if Dave was going to be in the film. Mm -hmm. you, you have to license this out. Give us the, the license fee. And they said, that's the last we heard. So then... <laughs> Then we went to the lawyers, and the lawyer said, yeah, you, you can, if you want, you could probably sue these people. And, and then yeah. your uh, attorney said, no, it's fair use because it's a documentary. Well, hoo-ha, guess what? It's no documentary. <laughs> it, was a, it was a theatrical ruse, right? Okay, yes. Yeah. So, so, so and I'm us? in it, I, and I'm in it, and as you mentioned here, at a pivotal point in the film, where, oh, my God, what has happened, what has happened? I go to the show, uh, and, and Letterman crushes me. Oh, my life is over, my career, what have I done, what have I done, what have I done? Well, now you owe me a million bucks. A million bucks. A million dollars. We've made 75 cents on this movie. That's not my problem. I don't That's know not how my you can problem. For Look, a all of the promotion you got from uh, being on here that night when you yeah. were, you know, when you're Dr. Drew. Oh my God. <laughs> All of that's worth something. That's free publicity. So we want a little something for that. And then, okay. and my talent fee, you know, it's not my first rodeo. <laughs> I'd like a little taste of this as well. So you and Casey get together with your little buddy and come up with a million. That's all I'm asking. Okay. Who, 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 how many minutes is the film? I have no idea. Who's no, the no, little no, buddy? How, well, like it's an hour and a half? Um, I think it okay, feels so like it's seven five, hours. I, <laughs> uh, I'm in it five uh, minutes at a pivotal point. A okay. point. I, 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 I am the denouement. Can, can you call my agent? No, I'm not calling anybody. Okay, this can is, you I have my agent call this. you? No, 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 no. I no. don't talk to people on the phone. We are... <laughs> it's you and me right here. Okay, fine. Mano a mano. Hey, do it. don't make me call Mavrakakis. Okay, listen. We'll, we'll work it out. But um, can we talk about it privately? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we'll go to one of your screenings. Uh, <laughs> Appreciate it. Stop it. Stop yeah. it. That's good. The decent kid. Uh, let's uh, show people a clip. It's called I'm Still Here. What are we going to see, Joaquin? Uh, this is a scene in which I am performing in Miami, and uh, Heckler, who is actually a friend of ours, a great actor named Eddie, um, is an paid? audience. Was he paid? <laughs> Did you pay he Eddie? Was not, he was not Eddie paid. was not paid. He was not paid. Well, uh, uh, Eddie will get a little taste of my settlement, but believe he, me. <laughs> uh, and, and so uh, he heckles me from the audience, and uh, I jump in and have a bit of a scuffle. All right, here we go. I'm still here. Joaquin Phoenix in theaters now. Well, uh, I'll say this, uh, people have found this uh, more or less fascinating now for a year and a half. Mm -hmm. So I guess that's something, isn't it? <laughs> that is something. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Something. yeah. And now with the uh, million dollars, everything here is cool. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have a million dollars in I don't bank care. account. You'll that come was, up with it. Casey's no, line. no, you'll be fine. You'll get the money somewhere. <laughs> all right, all right, good. Uh, there it is. I'm still here in theaters now. Joaquin Phoenix. Oh, it's a pleasure, my friend. Thank you very much. I'll be right back with Tom Jones, everybody.